This is just a quick demo to show how I was using the Mars X-Ray to read control lines. So all I have is kind of an empty assembly file. We'll just write a really simple line here, really handy command at this point. We'll demonstrate the point. So we're just gonna run an add command, compile that. Once it's compiled and successful, we're gonna go up to tools, MIPS X-Ray. Uh, we're gonna connect to MIPS. Once it's connected, we're gonna use the step through feature here to let it step through. We'll now go ahead and see that the instruction is correct. And once the instruction is loaded there, we can go ahead, go through and look at the control lines. We'll see that these are color coded to the different signals here for what it's reading from the instruction. So you can see the blue and the blue. But the most important piece that we're gonna do here to read the control signals is we're gonna click on this control area here. When we click on that, we'll see an additional window open up. Now this has the lines in, but the most important part here is how the color coding works in this screen. What you're gonna see is everything that comes in to these output line, reg dest, ALU source, mem to reg, write mem, so on and so forth. These you should recognize. When these control lines come out, red, that represents a one, meaning that value has been asserted. And when it comes across as gray, it represents a zero, meaning that line is not asserted. So we can see reg dest is one, al source zero, mem to reg zero, write reg one, so on and so forth. So that's how you read those through this system.